the game changer we didn't see coming. Every few years, Apple surprises us with a product that completely redefines expectations. And this time, it's the iPad Mini's turn. For years, the Mini has been loved for its size, portability, and convenience. But with the upcoming iPad Mini 8, Apple is taking things far beyond what anyone expected. This isn't a minor refresh. This is a full-scale leap in power, display, and intelligence, built for the next generation of performance-hungry users who want something small yet unstoppable. A bold move, Apple's compact revolution. Apple's decision to supercharge the iPad mini isn't random. The company has been reshaping its product lineup streamlining the iPad Air and iPad Pro series while making the Mini a serious contender for power users. According to internal leaks and firmware code spotted earlier this year, the iPad Mini 8 will be powered by the A19 Pro chip, the same silicon that fuels the iPhone 17 Pro. This is the first time Apple's most powerful chip makes its way into the smallest iPad. And that means, for the first time, the Mini is no longer just a compact iPad. It's a performance monster. Under the hood, the A19 Pro engine. At the heart of this transformation lies the A19 Pro chip, built on TSMC's 3-nanometer and 3P architecture. This design focuses on raw efficiency and power balance. The result? Lightning-fast processing, enhanced AI computation, and drastically better thermal management. The chip features a redesigned 16-core neural engine, which powers Apple's latest on-device AI capabilities from smart photo editing and real-time translations to advanced generative features under Apple Intelligence. With this chip, the iPad Mini 8 won't just handle day-to-day -day tasks. It'll rival laptops in raw performance. Unleashing console-level power. Gaming on a small tablet has always been fun, but never this serious. Apple's Metal 3 graphics API and the A19 Pro's improved GPU bring real-time ray tracing, smoother rendering, and console-quality visuals to a device that fits in one hand. That means games like Resident Evil Village, Assassin's Creed Mirage, and even future AAA mobile titles will run effortlessly on the Mini 8. For creators, that GPU muscle translates into faster video rendering, smoother Procreate workflows, and near-desktop-level editing performance. This is Apple's most compact yet most capable gaming-ready tablet to date. RAM, efficiency, and AI, the perfect blend. One of the biggest changes comes in the memory department. The iPad Mini 8 is rumored to come with 12 gigabytes of RAM, a huge jump from its predecessor's 8 gigabytes. This isn't just about multitasking, it's about AI readiness. Apple's new ecosystem of intelligent features in iPad OS 19, such as live translation, summarization, and generative visuals, relies on plenty of RAM to work smoothly offline. So even as Apple continues to expand its AI offerings, the Mini 8 will stay future-proof for years. The display everyone's been waiting for, OLED, finally arrives. This is the upgrade that fans have been asking for since 2019, and it's finally here. Multiple reliable sources, including Bloomberg and display supply chain consultants, suggest that Apple has secured OLED panels from Samsung for the iPad Mini 8. This means richer colors, deeper blacks, better contrast, and higher power efficiency. Reading, watching movies, or even drawing will feel far more immersive. Now. Apple may opt for a single-stack LTPS OLED panel, likely capped at 60 Hz, but there's buzz that a 90 Hz refresh rate could be introduced as a surprise middle ground, giving users the fluidity of promotion without draining too much power. Even if it stays at 60 Hz, OLED's crisp quality alone will make this the best screen ever on a small iPad. Design evolution, same size, sharper feel. The iPad Mini May 8 not look drastically different at first glance but subtle refinements will make it feel more premium than ever. Expect thinner bezels, a slightly refined chassis, and possibly new colors matching the iPhone 17 lineup. Apple might also tweak the button layout or move the front camera to the landscape orientation, a feature that debuted with the iPad 10. That simple change could make video calls feel more natural, a small but meaningful improvement for everyday users. Camera and audio upgrades. Apple isn't turning the iPad mini into a camera-first device, but improvements are on the way. The 12MP rear sensor will report it all. Why get better low-light capabilities and more natural color tones? Thanks to the new image signal processor inside the A19 Pro chip. The front camera will continue to support center stage, ensuring you remain in the frame during calls, and audio quality could receive a major lift with quad speakers, 
giving the Mini the same audio punch as the iPad Air. Performance meets portability. Here's the real magic. Apple has managed to fit desktop class performance into an 8-inch form factor without compromising on battery or heat. Thanks to improved thermal management and efficient silicon, the iPad Mini 8 could maintain peak performance longer than the iPhone 17 Pro. That means creators, gamers, and professionals finally get a small, light device that performs like a machine twice its size. A perfect mini for the modern world. In essence, the iPad Mini 8 is Apple's message to the tech world. That size no longer limits capability. Whether you're a student, traveler, designer, or casual user, this device bridges the gap between portability and power like never before. It's not just an upgrade. It's a redefinition of what a mini can be. The big question, when is it coming? When it comes to Apple launches, timing is everything. And for the iPad Mini 8, the timeline seems to be a carefully calculated move rather than a random update. Industry analysts, including Bloomberg's Mark Gurman and Ross Young from DSCC, suggest that Apple has been finalizing its OLED supply chain throughout 2025, with full production expected to ramp up in early 2026. That means the iPad Mini 8 could debut either. Alongside the next-generation iPad Air and iPad Pro refresh in spring 2026, or as a standalone fall launch, giving Apple's smaller tablet its own spotlight moment. Considering Apple's usual strategy, a spring 2026 reveal seems most likely, as it allows the company to introduce new iPads early in the year before the iPhone 18 lineup steals the spotlight later. So if you're planning to buy the new iPad mini, mark your calendar. March or April 2026 could be when Apple finally unveils its smallest yet most powerful tablet. Pricing strategy, Apple's smart balancing act. Pricing has always been a key factor in the iPad mini's identity. It's not cheap, but it's always positioned as a more accessible premium option.